To be able to import new 3D models into the Giants Editor, it is best to use i3D files exported directly from Maya. While the new Giants Editor does support FBX files, we recommend saving the object as an i3D file, as it not only saves you having to convert the file in Giants Editor, but also means that you can import the object complete with correct properties and attributes. The Giants Engine SDK panel includes all the appropriate exporter plugins. The plugins can also be found in the GDN, the Giants Developer Network. In order to download the plugins, you will need to have a registered user account with us and be logged in. When logged into the GDN, you can find the relevant exporter plugins under Downloads, with plugins available for the 3DS Max, Maya and Blender applications. Once the relevant files have been downloaded, we can begin with the installation. The setup program has two different options for installing the exporter plugins. The first and easiest is the new and fully automatic plugin installation. In this case, the setup program should detect the version of Maya that we have installed, as we can see in the window here. All we have to do now is click the Install button and the necessary files will be copied over automatically by the installer. The installer will also copy across all the required settings from Maya to enable you to use the exporter. The other method for installing plugins is through manual installation, which those of you who have used earlier versions of the exporter will already be familiar with. As we have already performed the automatic installation, we can now close the setup program and start Maya. You can find the exporter here in the Giants Shelf tab. Clicking on the i3D symbol will let us launch the exporter. With it we can now export our created objects, saving them in the i3D format. We'll see exactly how this works in the next tutorial.